state's birthday celebrations continue out in the small mountain town of Buena Vista. People might disagree on how to exactly say that town's name if it's Buena or Buena, Buena if you ask the locals. But they won't disagree that the town is a very important part of Colorado's story. Matt Croshaw found that story is changing in a big way. It doesn't always cooperate. At 12 years young, Jacob Young, behind the controls of this model railroad, there we go. That takes up an entire room. It was created by three men about 20 years ago. It took them about eight years. The trains represent the entire Arkansas River Valley from the mines up north. It gives you more of an idea of why stuff happened. And it also just shows you what stuff used to look like, as well as motives for what, like, why the courthouse is a museum today. They're housed safely inside the Buena Vista Heritage Museum. Alongside artifacts, reminding everyone of the rich history this place holds. We have a very colorful history. It all started when we uh, first became the county seat. We uh, we ended up holding the sheriff and his wife up in Granite at gunpoint to steal the court documents that we had won in the election. This museum houses those reminders from the past, but the staff here is well aware of the changes happening in the present. It is a very different beast than you know ten years ago. It was a completely different atmosphere. And now, you know, one of us is coming alive. And it's great to be able to share our stories with all the people who are coming to visit. Streets are full of visitors coming to experience this special mountain valley. What better way to hang out in a museum than on a nice museum rainy day? <laughs> They're adding to the story that is Buena Vista. In Chafee County, I'm Matt Croshall, and I'm covering Colorado First. And in celebration of Colorado Day, Colorado Parks and Wildlife offers free entry to all 41 state parks. It's on Monday, August 5th. Coming up.